There are now just three weeks before the midterm election and at stake is control of the House and possibly the Senate. And one of the Senate races is here in Pennsylvania, where the incumbent, Democrat Bob Casey, is being challenged by Republican Congressman Lou Barletta of Hazleton. For Barletta, the campaign turned ugly and personal when the Casey campaign aired this ad. In Congress, Barletta voted to let insurance companies strip coverage for pre-existing conditions. Why would I ever vote for Lou Barletta? Barletta is especially sensitive to the Casey ad because one of his grandchildren has cancer. This whole campaign has been scaring senior citizens, scare people who are sick, and then go after a family when they're down. Uh, you know, dealing with, a, with an 18-month-old child who has cancer, it's just, uh, I can't tell you how disappointed, hurt, angry, and I, all the emotions that you can imagine I feel for my family, for my daughter, and shame on him. When Barletta went on social media to complain about the ad, the Casey campaign did pull it, but only in Barletta's hometown market of Scranton. It's so bad that, that it can't be viewed in Scranton, but not so bad for the people of Pittsburgh, and not so bad for the people of Allentown. And, and, and how does he think I feel as I travel around the state and I'm in a hotel room and I see, see the ad, or my daughter? You know, you know that, that politics gets like this, though. No, it doesn't get like this. No, no, it doesn't. No, it doesn't, nor should it. And in an interview with me this morning, Barletta was also critical of the leadership of his own party for not having a plan in place when they voted to repeal Obamacare. Hell yeah. I mean, hell yeah. We had six years to get something that, that should have been... That should have been uh, ironed out. Listen, it wouldn't have been perfect and it would have been ugly at the hearings, of course, but at the end of it, we would have fixed the problems. Barletta has endorsed and embraced President Trump, and he knows there are many who dislike the president. But he told me that even if the election is a referendum on the president, he believes it becomes personal to the voter. I just believe that when people get in that voting booth, they're going to say, listen, we are better off now than we were two years ago. We are better off now than we were when Bob Casey and his friends uh, and, and President Obama were in charge. And, and why, do you want to, why would we want to stop that? And we reached out to Casey for a one-on-one, -on -one, but his representatives have not contacted us back yet. Don't forget, KDKA's U.S. Senate debate between Barletta and Casey has been rescheduled. The debate will now air at 7 p.m. on Friday, October 26th.